Thompson sponsors STV Weather. And finally, they became some of the brightest stars of the Commonwealth Games. Volunteers and Clydesiders organized crowds, welcomed athletes, and performed in the opening and closing ceremonies. One year on, their enthusiasm is still being hailed as one of the reasons the Glasgow Games was such a success. Lucy White met up with some of them to see how taking part impacted on their lives. This is Elizabeth. One year ago at Glasgow Airport, she became the self-appointed, unofficial hugger of the Commonwealth Games. Lovely to see you! Today she dusted off those same skills to catch up with fellow volunteers. The buzz, the electricity, and it was when you checked your uniform at night, you checked your timetable, and the taxi came at half past five in the morning, and you were at the airport meeting and greeting as you walked in. We got to keep that, and that was with Lisa as well the before. And that was from being a flag bearer, is that flag bearer, right? uh -huh. You were saying to me beforehand that this is not something that you would normally do. You wouldn't usually put yourself forward for something like this. No, no not, not at all. I just decided out of the blue just to audition and I was successful. And then it escalated from the opening to the closing <laughs> to George Square. Um, I've just done so much. So how has it actually changed your life now? I would go for anything. Mm. I would do anything. Um, at all. I volunteer now uh, for McMillan Cancer Support, so I probably wouldn't have done that before. I was part of a group of 500 uh, performance in full state, really, really close, still connecting Facebook, joining other activities and groups, but it's really built up that bit of confidence that you really need to go for other things, for opportunities that maybe before you wouldn't have felt so secure about. Volunteering has had a life-changing impact for Julie. She has cerebral palsy and has been inspired by the accessibility of the Games to keep championing parasports in Scotland. I have to go out and promote it, champion it, engage with so many people across the spectrum, and it changed my life. We can't have a legacy. A legacy is. It doesn't happen to you. You've got something.